car never works. It's always breaking down on my... Yes! Good Kente. Seems to be the problem over here. That, that, that's a dead body! Holy hell! Where did that come from? I think I have CSI on the phone. Yeah! This area is secure. So it seems to be the 
problem here. Holy hell, what happened here? Is that what you're supposed to be finding out? I'm gonna have to ask you guys to leave with me. Alright, we have to open it. Okay. Jinkies! What'd you find? A wallet! What's in it? A phone number! Okay, well, this is where she said she lived. Okay. Well, hi, you must be the CSI guys that called me. Come on in, you guys. Come on, girls. What seems to be the problem? They called me earlier. They said you had some questions. What's the questions? Well, it seems that we found a wallet in the desert and it had your phone number in it. Oh, yeah? Okay. So, so what seems to be the big problem? Do you know a guy named James? Oh, yeah. That was, that was, uh, he's, we're engaged now. And, uh, what happened was, we were wet and wild. It was, uh, 2006. And, uh, we're, we're together. And I was in a thong kind of thing going on, you know, the yellow ones. So we're, we're hanging out. I see him on the lifeguard thing. I was like, oh my god, I have to have it. So I drowned in the pool. He came, gave me CPR, gave him tongue to tongue, you know how to do it. And then we've been heading out for some months. Okay, um, you have some bad news. James is dead. <laughs> do you have everything under control? Yes, I do. Do you know anyone that would want to hurt James? My ex-boyfriend, Johnny Stanton. And how do you know he did this? He's always been jealous ever since I left him for James. Such an ass. Okay, I think we have everything. Okay. Well, have, have a good day. Oh, yes. Do you know anything about a murder? We gotta run after him! Why didn't you give her love a chance? Because James is a better lover than you. No! 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 Oh. 